Derwin. Yes? You're living in this tent in Las Vegas. I am. You said you've been here two years. Back two years. Yeah. Right. Tell me about homelessness in Las Vegas. Well, um, it's horrible. Um, it's not the people. Uh, you can eat. You eat well. People bring food. It's yeah. not, it's, that's in clothes and things. But it's the uh, same like mostly it's the ones with, home, with nice homes that have a true hatred. I don't know why, but it's horrible. So the, the house people hate y'all? Yes. Yes, they do. What's that make you feel like? Oh, man. Uh, I feel like a piece of shit at times, and then I see them as that way too. Uh, it make me make me not want to uh, take my frustrations out on the next person that I meet. So that's the way I have to look at it. And you're di you're disabled on SSI. Yes. So you got a couple wheelchairs out here. Yes. Yes. Police department uh, arrest me for. Uh, trespass, I'm, we're actually trespassing uh, right now. Uh, but in the morning, is you, you can go to jail. Uh, yeah, uh, is, I don't understand it. it. There's nowhere for us to go. Yeah, uh, everywhere is a trespass, and then they take you to jail if they want to. And, it, and it's a $1,000 fine or six months in jail. Yes, yes it is. For but being homeless. Yes, but yeah, it's very expensive. But you have to do at least probably at least a week or two. I've done I've done 20 days and then and, and, and 10 days. So you've been arrested in jail time for homelessness? Yes, yes. They call it trespassing. That's it's, horrible. It is. It is. And uh, and it's even worse once you're inside. No one can get to see what the what the, what, what the officers really do. I'm so sorry. Yeah. Well. So am I, but I'm not afraid to tell the truth. Right. Well, mm. you're telling me, you know, you get disability, but it's not enough to, the rents went up $250 a month, and then, yes. you know, your checks didn't go up $250 it, a month? It, it did not. I think our checks went up $15 that year. That was two years ago, uh, 2000. Yeah. I went in, uh, the year before that, I went back down south and for one year, and I returned. I had, I had been here eight years. I went back for one year, came back, and now I've been back two years. And uh, I had a nice apartment, and, it, and, 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 and I was able to maintain. And uh, with government assistance, of course, they're on the light bills and things like that, but I was able to pay for it out of my check. But when it went up $250, it went over the, 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 the amount of my check. And then you're back outside. Yes, yes, I try to stay at a hotel. It can't be done. All right. so it's not enough money in your check. Yeah. Right. So I ended up in a tent, which damaged damaged me last winter. I got I, 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 a neuropathy in my in my foot. It, just, uh, it gets cold out here. People mm -hmm. don't realize. They think Vegas is the desert and it gets hot. Yes. But it's been. 20, 30 degrees at night. Yes, and it's just the worst. It's like just when the sun is coming up and that's the time they ask you to move and get up and pack your things and go out there, they'll take, the, they'll, they'll take their, little, their, their little bulldozers and their little tractors and scoop your stuff up and, take it and you'll be arrested. Oh my gosh. Yeah, you got to move really fast. You got to wake up cold and you have to pack your stuff up and people be crying. Yeah, it, it's horrible. Um, and then you have to go and sometimes you just have to leave everything you got. Right. Right. Well, start all over again, so, which which is real, most of it comes from uh, donations and gifts from other people that you never met before. So that make it twice as hard to start over because you just can't go in a store. You can't do that because if you carry your backpack and stuff, they don't want you to go inside. The casinos are the same, um, and, and, and it just they, they just judge you before you even get there. My goodness. Right. You can't take backpacks in the stores. And people have they, 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 everything in their life in there at times when they have to go and take care of their business. Because yeah. yeah. if you leave it in your tent, mm, it gets stolen. It's going to get stolen. Right. Which is the most heinous crime of all. I think they are the lowest of the lowest people on the face of this planet. Uh, one homeless person stealing from another one. Yeah, but people are in survival mode. 
Yes. Yeah. Yes, but the the, uh, the the other homeless is the one that's going at the end of the day going really, really going to help you through it. Yeah. When you need something, they're going to come through for you every time. If you had three wishes, what would they be? Mm, no more homelessness for sure. Not as a person that chooses just I just rather sleep outside. And some people like that. I've met a lot of veterans like that. I know a lot of veterans like that. They don't. They have places and they prefer to live outside. So no more homelessness. That would be my first wish. Mm, the second wish would be this. I mean, uh, just the, just the basics of the, you know, not no more stealing. No more taking, no more robbery, no more, no more of that. It's, it's senseless. Uh, and third is just, we all can just have some peace. Great wishes. Yes. Thank you very much for talking to me. Thank you very much.